Hello guys, welcome back to another episode of Fan Mail. So, out of this big stack of shit, how much do you think is actually from fans? This. This is the only thing I have from a fan. Now, before we get started with this stack of garbage, let's talk about the last episode, okay? I know my behavior may have been just a little bit questionable. <gasps> I was acting like I just got out of the uh, mental institution, I know. I don't get a lot of things in fan mail, and of the things I do get in fan mail, a lot of them aren't super interesting. I got a bottle of lotion. Would you rather have me just open up a box and say, hey, look, I got a bottle of lotion. I decided that I wanted to eat it, okay? Because that's crazy. No one does that, and that makes people watch. Clearly it didn't work. Maybe we gotta try another approach. I'm not a lunatic, all right? I'm not nuts, all right? It's just lotion. I put it in my mouth and then I spit it out. It's not that big of a deal, okay? Here we have a package addressed to dad, I, dad, Ian, all crossed out. And then it says mayhem at the top. I just put in a fresh camera battery and it's already... What? Anyways, let's open up this envelope that has been sitting in my room for about a month. And let's see what we got inside here. Alright, first we got a little note that says Riptide. Thank you very much, Riptide, for your uh, generous donation. Alright, I don't know if you guys can see this, but... Uh, nice. Alright, so what do we got here? We got some little Japanese candy. Sorry, I needed a thumbnail. I don't even know if that's going to be it. But anyways, we got some Japanese candy. I don't know what flavor this is. This might be poisoned. I'm not sure. Let's just pop it in. Hey, that's pretty good. It's a very interesting flavor. It's like fizzing in my mouth. Is candy supposed to seem like it's going to blow up? It's pretty good. I'm going to try two at once. This one's like red and yellow. I don't know what flavor it is. Let's just pop it in and see. The other one's still fizzing. Wow, this one's pretty good. Do you guys like ASMR? The light blue one? It kind of has like a soap flavor to it. It's like something you'd get at like a Texas Roadhouse bathroom. I like it. Thank you, Riptide. Now, you're probably wondering what we have here. Well, we have mostly a bunch of ads for visiting North Carolina. Car what's this for? Um, thoroughbred country. More like inbred country. I don't know what they want me to do with all this stuff. Like, it's, it's literally, it just keeps going. It just keeps going. And mostly all of it is addressed to Mayhem Polecat. Like, I, I don't understand. Let's, let's crack one open. See what we got in the Alabama one. Seriously, this is too big. I don't know how they fit all of that in an envelope. I, I can't fold this thing back up. So, most of them are from uh, North Carolina, Alabama. We have a couple Arizona. Uh, essentially, I could open my own library. Here we go. Let's delve into this adventure. Oh, boy. What's this? The Rocky Mountain Majesty, huh? We're in Montana. And I also have one that is addressed to um, Ian Duckface. So I was thinking about what to do with this stuff. And I was like, I don't know what I want to do with it. There's not much you can do with a bunch of paper. But I was thinking about destroying it somehow. Or doing some creative idea with it. So I wanted to leave that up to you guys. What do you guys think I should do with all this stuff? Because... I don't just want to throw it away. I want to make a video out of it. I want to make some content, you know? I have no use for it. I just have no use.
Thanks. See you in the next one. I got a little bank notice um, for my grandma that passed away several years ago. So that's also nice to get in the mail.